Noku right now I even now know playing. Phantom was here. Mr. Yeah, L versus John Numbers Sinjin. is out, dude. Yeah. Mr. L taking Mr. L taking it over John Numbers. I would be John too. <laughs> All right, we're getting into this game. We gotta can't dwell so much on what's happening in losers when there's a winner's semis right in front of us and oh here is where it all falls apart for Yoshi and here's where maybe it all falls apart for uh, Lucina yeah well not just yet he's at pretty low percent so he's able to make it back but he's gonna get to high percent with this combo here <laughs> Oh, that Tomahawk grab. Great option from Mr. E. And DI's out from that neutral air. He's going to be surviving, but oof. The Yoshi's airspeed lets that air dodge, like the neutral air dodge, basically become like a pseudo directional air dodge. Uh, yeah. Mr. E was ready for it regardless. Yeah, he's been in the situation so many times, so he's like, yo, I know what you're going to do. And this is not his first time playing Miles. They have played before, not often, but they do play. I'm pretty sure Mr. He has the set. Oh, DBZ moment. You, if you are Miles, you are taking that. Yeah, no, I'd definitely take that. I'm like, yo, I'm GameStop today. <laughs> All right, now Mr. E just pressing his advantage. If you're Miles, like, how do you get back to stage? He now has no jump, forced to recover. I love that, knowing to go behind him, cross him up, so at the very least he gets his resources back. Yeah, but Mr. E still just has him in the disadvantage state. So, Matt still, like, in disadvantage. And right. Now look at that. And Miles finally gets to play the game, but he took 132 for it. Yeah, but we all know the combos that Miles is capable of. Oh, good stuff there, not falling for that down smash trap that we've seen Mr. E do before. Yeah, if you DI'd in, you were dead. And Miles would have killed him if he got that there. Good job just trying to DI away. You know, I will say, uh, Mr. E was doing an amazing job, and then he messed up once, didn't have Miles in disadvantage anymore, and now he's already taken 100. Yeah, they were all... I think this is just playing this game at top uh -huh. level, and to show you can up B, out of Dolphin Slash, whatever you want to call it, out of... That hit stun, this netting Mr. E, that stock. And now this is that low percent where Yoshi's just really scared. <gasps> that should have been an up air, but I don't know, drifted the wrong way, was not anticipating Mr. E's DI. Armor's oh throwing, but doesn't get the hit. He was not quite well positioned enough to get the up air. Still not enough, wow. He wanted, I think he wanted to parry the second hit of that neutral air. And yeah. finally getting the stock here. Well, think about the, this. Um, Miles was basically at 140 and then hit Mr. E once and took him to about 100. And, there? Yeah, okay. But he needs to get off ledge in order to do that. Now, one thing that's worth noting is that Miles, on his recoveries, he's not really throwing eggs. Yeah. You know, he's not. I, I, I feel like that is a distinct choice on his part it's it's i can understand why you need your eggs as a resource for getting some extra height mm -hmm. but then again just having an egg coming down that might be able to either help cover you so as you're moving maybe or he knows mr e knows something about that <laughs> like some counterplay and just doesn't want to do it because it'll just probably like put him in even worse situation yeah it is true that if mr e is anticipating he could just jump double jump out there and back at him before yeah. that egg ever comes out so Okay. <laughs> oh, what a parry. Ooh, but Mr. E not respecting the double jump armor that Yoshi does have. Okay, down tilt. Oh, just back. Jump back fair. <laughs> I think that's like the mile special. Whoa, like, this spot. I, I will never understand how Mr. E is able to react to these things, whether he anticipates them or what. I think that, that one's more of an anticipation. Because that's the spot Miles, you see how he got this grab right there. But that's the spot Miles does like to, and a lot of other Yoshis do like to do that grab now. Yeah, and I was saying how, oh, he's not really throwing eggs. That's probably the reason why we just saw that Mr. E was absolutely ready for it and got the kill for it. And, oh, but an immediate response. Miles only taking 12% and getting that uh, comeback. Yeah. That really nice uh, and I, stock. Yeah, and I do like this stage for Yoshi. You see, he's able to use the P oh. PS2 platforms. To extend his combos and <laughs> almost taking the stock right there. At the very least, he got a ton of damage on Mr. E. And oh, I'm liking the way he's now trying to pressure on Mr. E's shield. 
see the beginnings of up smash right there. He's trying to go for some anti-air options, using maybe a little bit of intangibility from himself in order to... <laughs> Ooh. That reversal? Oh, that's Damn. it! And that, man. Miles is so good at converting with that egg in that situation. He just knows like a lot of people like to neutral get up and just punishes it accordingly. You know, we're seeing Miles shield a lot more. I wonder if we're going to start seeing some shield breakers come out from Mr. E. Not killing at all. I guess that was a sour spot of the move. Yeah, it, it feels like it was. That should be it. Yep. Okay. 61%. Nothing to scoff at, but nothing like too hard to like come back from. As he already gets 25% onto oh! a bad drift in. Well, he threw out that hitbox and that hurtbox shifting from Miss uh, from Miles rather. Yeah, trick me once, shame on me. Fool me twice, shame on you, me, <laughs> me. <laughs> no? Wait, uh -oh. I'm so confused. <laughs> Let's talk about the game. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, no, I do want to talk about this. Mile, if he loses this stock right here, that's it. He's in the loser's bracket. But he's so close. Has the air. He gets it. That's enough. Catching his landings. Catching Lucina's landings as Yoshi is so hard to do. Think about the exact spacing he needs to be in to get the back hit of that up tilt. He's managing to bring Mr. E to a game three right now. Yeah. And winner of this gets to face Quid in winner's finals. Oh my god, if we have Miles Quid in winner's finals for the third goddamn week in a row. Scripted. I'm sorry, no, that was Grand's first week, but like still. Scripted. Did you not read? I, I, I handed it to you. I sent you the file over You Discord. sent me the file. I skimmed it. <laughs> I skimmed sk it. <sighs> this is why... But <laughs> I thought there needed to be some changes. Oh, 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 I see. You come in here after we've written the whole script and you have great ideas for yeah. changes. I'm like the Tom Cruise of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I have a great idea. What if I beat Venia? Yo. <laughs> Nobody will see it coming. Nobody. <laughs> I don't know why that's my imitating you voice. It's okay. <laughs> All right, we're getting into game three here and immediately miles trying to start off with a down air but down air is good if you think your opponent is going to throw out a move but why would mr e not throw out a move yeah well mr e known to be more aggressive and already getting caught from jumping from ledge right there <gasps> that call out on that jump was so good and oh he's spacing outside of this oh that it oh my god what that was so yeah and now miles has the lead Miles has a pretty dang big lead. Mr. E has to be finding some way to close the gap right now. Oh, I love that air dodge down. Because a lot of people expect an attack right there. Or something. And you just don't give it to them. Oh! And he gets... Oh, if he hadn't connected with the ledge there, he probably could have lived that just barely. But, uh... Okay, just double jumping armoring out. Yeah. Yeah, so I think he was trying to punish another roll read right there, but Mr. E this time around not really falling for that. Yeah. And Mr. E's now just playing more jump heavy and not reacting as much. Ooh. <sighs> Did you notice the way he so he used his double jump so that he would have like a, a pseudo no impact land once he got to the stage there. Yeah, that's really dope. Okay. Not gonna work right there, but that almost kills him. That still this hasn't touched the ground yeah, before no. it was lava. Oh! This could be it. Can he actually get the shield? punish out of here? Okay, not just yet. 150% onto Miles. He's managing to drift back. Mr. E looking for the final blow. He's not able to find it, and the down smash is enough. Yeah, just up he's the wrong way. Unfortunate. Oh. Okay, 166. Uh, okay. really? Oh, that doesn't kill the- What was that DI? I don't know. But it, he, he's living because of it. And this is the sort of thing where at this percent, when you are Miles recovering, just double jump in his face. Because if he hits you, then you get knocked far away enough that you're not going to die usually because of the reduced knockback. Okay. Up tilt. 
the anti-air option. That down air from Yoshi can be really good, but against a player like Mr. E who can just react to it, I'm not necessarily sure if that's the right call. It might not be. All right, what are we going to see? Oh, the air dodge down. Laz is starting to look to punish these jumps from Mr. E, but Mr. E is playing a lot more grounded right now. Yeah. Okay. Doing an aggressive option back on the stage. My, Mr. E thought he was going to roll there. Oh. oh, my God. Both these players are respecting each other so much, though. Is that no, enough? not just yet. Not just yet. Not just yet. Okay, shark the landing. That hit? Oh! No, not just yet. Oh. Uh -huh. He's at 159, gets back down to the ground, goes for the up smash. Why a down tilt? No! That's it, the pop up from Miles! That scramble situation! I don't know what happened, he up smashed his face and he down tilted. I think he wanted down smash.